here talking I'm a Celebrity. And last night, we saw Jordan North revealed as the first camp leader, voted for by the public. And according to the bookies, he's also currently the favourite to win the show. Is it too late to change my mind? Follow the first sign to Burnley. <laughs> I feel a bit sick, actually. I feel like kissing the ground. Happy place, happy place, yeah. turf more. Turf more. No, that's a big one. I've barely scarred. That's a good one. <laughs> we like to drink with Jordan. No, no, no. What did you have for your breakfast? <laughs> Eleven. 12! I put it in! The winner of the Royal Tournament is the Lords! Yay! Oh, that's so good. Oh, yes, Fernand! Come on, you go faster! <laughs> yeah, that's perfect. <laughs> Well, Jordan's close friend, etiquette expert William Hansen, joins me now. It's lovely to see you, and he's now the bookie's favourite to win. Um, you know, he's been voted camp leader. He's doing really well. He's doing so well. I, I knew that, that he would do well. I didn't really appreciate it would be this level of well, and also this quickly as well. He is conquering his fears. I think he's going to, whenever he leaves the castle, he is going to be a totally different person to the one he was going in. Much, uh, he won't be as afraid of everything, I think, but he's still, his big fear is rats, I believe. Yeah, um, enclosed spaces is as big, and probably on on a par with that is rats. And he's oh yet to do anything that that mm. is rat related. Right. Uh, he, he dodged a bullet last night with mm. this this trial that we're going to see tonight. That involves rats, but there's still plenty of time. Oh, there certainly is. <laughs> now, look on the surface, you two might not have all that much in common. How how did you meet, and how did you become so close? We met about 11 years ago. Uh, I was a, a guest on a radio station and Jordan was on work experience there. He hadn't even started his, his radio career. And he was asked to sort of chaperone me and show me to the studio and, and back out. And we just made each other laugh. Mm -hmm. And then we, I thought, well, he's nice. We won't keep in touch. But very nice. And then four years later, he moved in. Sorry, sorry, four months later, he moved in with two of my close friends from university. Oh. And we said, well, oh, hello, it's you. <laughs> and uh, and we sort of struck it off from there. And and we do, you know, we are different, but we just seem to, to make each other laugh and share quite a lot of similar values. No, you do very much so. And, and William, you had to apparently have therapy in order to watch I'm a Celebrity, is that right? Uh, yes, and really, Jordan should have had quite a lot of therapy before he, he did the programme. Um, but I'm also petrified of rats and mice. Uh, even if one comes on the screen, I can't cope. And, and as we know with I'm a Celebrity, especially in a castle in Wales, rats play quite a, a pivotal role. So I thought in order to, for me to be able to watch Jordan, I'm going to have to have um, hypnotherapy. So uh, I did. I've had it. It has worked. And there is an invoice with Jordan's name on it for when he comes out. <laughs> and, and why not? And why not? Are you voting for him to do all of these trials? <laughs> Uh, yes, I, I was. I am voting for him. Um, I feel slightly conflicted doing that because then when you see his little face uh, look slightly horrified that he's having to do it, I do get a pang of guilt. But, you know, I'm also doing a, a daily podcast that Jordan and I normally do a podcast. It's just me on my own with our producer at the moment. So we've got content to fill. I need him to do something. So I've got something to talk about. <laughs> well, exactly, exactly. And it's a funny, it's a really, really funny podcast. It is very, very funny. And the two of you, like you say, you just hit it off. When you'd expect you to be polar opposites, but somehow <laughs> it just, it just works. Now, look, he's talked a lot about his happy place. And this has had an amazing effect, hasn't it? Because we know he's a huge fan of Burnley. And it's it's really it's really helping in so many ways. It, it is. He he he's incredibly loyal to to his hometown and to his football club. Uh, I was thrilled to be taken there about a year and a half ago, and he he gave me a little tour uh, of Turf Moor. I mean, it's it's lovely. Um, it's a football ground, you know. Seen one, seen them all. But he he really likes it, uh, and and clearly it's what got him in that in that mood. I think that was a tactic that his eldest brother. Uh, who's a paratrooper had uh, had told him to do is if you're in a uh, an awkward situation, think of your happy place. And for Jordan's 
Uh, it's Turf Moor. Wouldn't work for me, however. <laughs> no, it wouldn't. But he's doing so well that actually the local, he doesn't realise this, but the local hospice has raised a lot of money. They've been printing T-shirts and things that people are buying, and that's fantastic. C completely, and he's he's got a close family connection to, to that hospice, and, and Pendleside Hospice will, well, I'm sure, be, be thrilled with what's happening. And Jordan, when he comes out and discovers what has happened, you know, two little words that, that have sparked... A, a great uh, charitable movement. He'll, I think, he'll be slightly tearful uh, at it in, in a in a in a good way. He's actually a really really sweet guy, um, and he and he is he is doing really well. And we're seeing we're seeing just how how much people like him, even though we're voting for him to do all of these trials. And um, it's with affection, I think. I think it's yes, with affection. Yes, it is. <laughs> It is. I, I think, you know, I, I haven't watched a lot of uh, I'm a Celebrity before this series, but I think what people seem to like is seeing these celebrities push to their limits and, and being able to, to sort of overcome their fears rather mm. than shouting the name of the of the programme and, and sort of whimpering out. I think uh, that's certainly in our household. Um, you know, we love Jordan so much. Obviously, he's a close friend, but we love him even more now. Oh, of course, absolutely. I can, oh, Luke, look at that bromance. We can actually see, I mean, the two of you, the two of you do your, your podcast together, but I could see you doing your own TV show, maybe, after this. Who knows? Well, who knows? Uh, I mean, as long as it doesn't involve rats. I mean, I am cured, but I still don't want to sort of uh, cuddle them uh, or do anything like that. But yes, who knows? Uh, he, could, he could show me his world. Uh, I'll show him mine. Sounds good to me. <laughs> Sounds very good to me. <laughs> William, what a joy to talk to you. Thank you so, so much for joining Thank us you, today. Right. It's lovely. And I'm a Celebrity, of course, continues tonight to nine o'clock on ITV. Don't forget, you can watch full episodes of Lorraine on the ITV Hub and all the best clips, compilations and playlists right here on our channel. Just subscribe now and you'll never miss an upload. Click here to watch another video similar to this one or click here to head to our channel's homepage to explore all of our exciting videos.